What's going on everybody? It's Dr. Gaming here bringing you guys another Bengals news video. Today we're going to be talking about the final preseason game against the Colts. And uh, unfortunately we lost, or maybe fortunately, depending how superstitious you are, uh, we lost 27-26. to 26. Uh, If you're like me, and you're a very superstitious person, and know the history of the Bengals uh, when they went undefeated, and uh, subsequently uh, did not make the playoffs afterwards. And the fact that the Browns went 4-0 of the year, they uh, didn't win a game. And I believe the Detroit Lions also did the same thing. Personally, I was actually hoping we were going to lose just because of that superstition. But anyway, uh, we're going to talk about the game. Uh, I, I watched parts off and on, but I got a good grasp of what I uh, thought of the game while watching it. I was uh, busy streaming. Uh, my uh, Madden series, my friend Nick, or I am Plage, uh, check that out whenever it decides to uh, process and post because YouTube apparently doesn't like to process my stream sometimes. But anyway, ugh, got some uh, spit stuck in my throat. I was trying to talk uh, after I said anyway. Anyway, uh, what did I think of the game? Again, I thought the Bengals played, played pretty good. Uh, one of the position battles, it more or less decided and, that, and the most important position battle and that's quarterback and it looks like Jeff Driscoll has beaten out Matt Barkley for uh, through two separate ways uh Matt Barkley went down with the injury in the first quarter and uh Jeff Driscoll played fairly decent today and uh personally I'm very happy you know that he that Jeff Driscoll is probably going to come down with the starting or not starting job wow that'd be really weird He's going to come to, uh, come away with the uh, backup job. Uh, I think that Mar Matt Barkley's probably going to get cut, considering he left the game. He he didn't come back. I I just I don't see Matt Barkley uh, as a viable backup. I don't see us keeping three quarterbacks, and if we do, I'd rather just see us keep Logan Woodside. But I have a feeling we're going to keep two quarterbacks. Uh, Jeff Striscoll will be the backup. Logan Woodside will go to the practice squad, and Matt Barkley is going to get cut. Sorry, Matt Barkley. You know, hopefully you find a job somewhere, but I got what I wanted. Hopefully I'm going to get what I'm hopefully. I, I, we will hopefully get what I want and what a lot of people want. But uh, anyway, uh, what I think about the offense line, um, I thought certain players did well. You know, Christian, uh, Christian Westerman did really well. But uh, some of our backups like uh, Kent Perkins looked fucking atrocious today. Uh, but I, I have a feeling, you know, this line's going to look decent. Uh, there was no set line today. People were rotating left and right everywhere. Uh, really the only people that have a set position is Cordy Glenn, Clinton Bowling, and Billy Price. So who knows what, who's going to be playing right guard or right tackle. But, uh, I thought they looked okay. They didn't look special, but they didn't look the worst in the world, in my opinion. Uh, if we're going to talk about defensive players that I thought looked good today, uh, or at least made a splash in some way or fashion, and, uh, that would be Malik Jefferson. Well, him and someone else. I'll, I'll get to them later. Malik Jefferson, uh, came down with a great fourth and one stop. Uh, it was a great tackle. Uh, oh man. I think I'm coming down with a cold and I'm having trouble, uh, talking as well. Uh, he finally did something this preseason. Uh, I was hoping we would see him do something. <laughs> Quite honestly, I was very fairly disappointed for a guy that, you know, we spent a third round pick, if I remember correctly, because uh, I believe Sam Hudrow was our second round pick. Uh, no. I think he would have been our fourth rounder, if I remember correctly. His, uh, second rounder was... Uh, was Jesse Bates, and then Sam Hubbard was the third round. No, I don't know. Whatever. He was a top four pick. A uh, top four round pick, you know, guy. Uh, I still think he, he had some uh, round one, round two grades going into the draft. I was hoping to see something out of him. We haven't been seeing anything in practice or in preseason. I'm, like, rambling here because I'm tired. I have a headache, and I'm trying to do this video, and I'm pretty sure I'm coming down with a cold. Uh... What else did I think? Well, I think that I'm very sad for one of our players. Uh, an un uh, undrafted uh, free agent uh, rookie, uh, Tavon Henderson. Uh, man, 
the guy made such a great play. We looked like we were going to win because of it. Uh, the interception, he, he goes to make a cut while running, and it looks like he's just tore his knee. And it looked like he was probably going to make the roster and take one of those DB spots. Uh, Trayvon, or yeah, it's Trayvon Henderson. I'm sorry, man. I, I hope that we can at least uh, give you another chance next year. I hope to see you guys on uh, see you on the uh, Bengals next year, possibly competing for a spot again. Uh, I think he honestly looked better than the some of our drafted corners. Like Darius Phillips, in my opinion, has looked doo doo. He's looked horrible. He doesn't look like he'd be a contributor on the team, whether it be as an actual defensive back or as a special team teamer like he's looked horrible he looked horrible today in my opinion and uh but overall the Bengals looked pretty good today the running game picked up a little bit walton and hill looked decent trey carson all of them uh i believe walton actually got injured near the end of the game that was near the when i started uh, not paying attention as much uh it's pretty weird to make a recap you know thoughts video on a game that you started to lose interest in but it's preseason at this point you know i just want to get into the actual regular season and uh i if i have any thoughts about this team i'm gonna probably make another video on who i think is gonna make the roster and what i think about this team overall and make a prediction video on how many wins do i think we'll win this season and uh that'll probably be the next video uh, either it'll be me making a prediction on who's going to make the roster. I, I don't know if I'll actually do something like that. It's not really my forte, uh, but I'll probably do a prediction video and uh, where I think this team will go, how many wins this team will get. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed uh, my little thoughts and ramblings here. Uh, I'm all over the place. I don't even know why. I should have just waited till tomorrow to make this video, but I thought I'm going to record this tonight. You know, even though I'm tired and all this shit, but uh, I'm Dog the Gamer. If you guys did like, leave a com, uh, leave a com. See, I, I can't even do the outro, which I already messed up enough as it is. I can't even do it half decently. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you have anything to say, leave a comment. Tell me what you thought of the game. Wh who do you think is going to make the team? Uh, you know, wh what did you think of our players today? Or, well, it's going to be yesterday by the time this is posted. And uh, if you like my videos, if you want to see more Bengals news, more, more Bengals videos in general, or just uh, gaming videos, Madden videos, NFL videos, I, I'm all over the place quite honestly. Subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell because YouTube may not notify you when I post a video. And uh, I know like when I'm subscribed to someone and I want to see their videos and uh, YouTube doesn't tell me and I go back just out of some weird ass feeling and I see oh I've missed like three videos from this guy even though I like his videos what the hell so anyway I'm dog the gamer hopefully I'm gonna be feeling better by the time I post my next video because I would prefer to be in a better clearer head you know and uh, I would like my prediction video to be a lot better than this video has been but I'm still posting it fuck it you know Dragging out this outro is weird. I, I'll see you guys later. I'm Dog the Gamer, and I hope you guys enjoyed.